hands. See, I'm here to assist you with mouth care. First, I'm going to close your door and wash my hands. Then I'm going to make sure I have all the appropriate equipment. Have a clothing protector, a cup with water, gloves, toothbrush, toothpaste, and an emesis basin. I'm going to position all my equipment. I'm going to raise your head up to the highest that you can tolerate, but at least 45 degrees. place this clothing protector across your chest so we won't dirty up your shirt. I'm going to wet my toothbrush and apply toothpaste. And then I'm going to brush his teeth. I'm going to brush the top surfaces, the side, and I'm going to start at the top. If you start at the top of the mouth, the person produces less saliva. You want to get all surfaces of the teeth, the top and both the sides. Okay, you want to ask them to hold their, put their teeth together so you can brush their teeth together. And then you want to brush the insides of the teeth. And throughout your procedure, you want to make sure you ask them if they need to spit. Okay, can you look out your tongue for me, please? And you want to brush the tongue using gentle motions. Try not to stick the toothbrush too far back into the throat so you won't induce the glad reflex. Then you want to sit your toothbrush on a clean surface. And you want to take your emesis basin and put the inward piece towards the chin. Swish that around your mouth and spit it out for me, please. And you want to do this a couple of times until you ensure that their mouth is cleaned out to their specifications. Okay. I'm going to go ahead and wipe your mouth off. I'm going to discard my protector into the dirty linen hamper. and dry my basin and clean off any excess toothpaste on the toothbrush and then I'm going to dry it and return it to the resident's bedside drawer then I'm going to take off my gloves using the glove to glove skin to skin technique and dispose of those in the trash can I'm going to wash my hands Give my resident his call light. I'm going to lower my bed. 